Uh, so I'm hearing this a lot. This is like the second person who put this in the comments that there are rumors of a three-year deal being offered to Amorim or Amorim. Uh, let's yeah. go with Amorim. Amorim sounds easier. Um, bad timing for all this in this chaos, you think? I realize the people who are doing those are not the guys who are playing and stuff, but there are guys who are playing who are probably reading the same rumors. Yeah, I... Uh... I don't know, but there's always going to be rumors with, with social media, right? Um, yeah. I think the tough thing is that there is something here that could have legs because like we talked about, it's it can be kind of frustrating. It can be a little nerve-wracking not knowing who the manager is that's coming in and not knowing what your place is going to be in the team potentially. And and that doesn't just land on fringe players, yeah. right? It lands on guys like Van Dijk and, and Mo um, that we've talked about. So, yeah, I mean, if that... So I guess it, it's up to literally the club themselves to sort of see where they're at, where the team is at, and if they feel like they need to have an answer. Because if it starts trickling into the locker room and that nervous anxiety starts to show through, it then you're just playing a poor game because of things that you're not that you're thinking about that you shouldn't really be thinking about, if you will.